Hello. Ooh. Ooh. What's up? What is going on? Also, I'm using that new uh, NVIDIA audio thing. Oh, I wonder how it affects the claps. Let's see. Dude, it mutes the claps. Dude, it mutes. We're going to have to get rid of it. Or I can just turn it on and off whenever I want. Wow, we. By the way, Crender, I want game code from you the other night. My husband has been loving it. You're a like style of games. So just want to let you know it's been put to good use. Nice. I'm glad he's enjoying it. Yeah, it's a fun game. I always enjoy when I get to play and promote games that I actually have a lot of fun playing. <laughs> I'm going to have to and disable it for now. Dude, that shit's crazy. I got to tell everybody. <laughs> what up what up thanks lizard spherix the 42 months yo dog what up lizard spherix one two three four five six seven eight nine double up thanks what they are the 42 months. Oh my god, Comrade with the 20 gifted subs. What the shit? Comrade, what is the occasion for the 20 gifted subs? Mamma mia. Flammable Lemon gets a sub. It's like Sparksy Live. It's like K Servin. It's like Chromium Oxide. It's like Fordress. It's like Shadowling McBeard. It's like Van Bummel. It's like Sir Crane. It's like Pos Poxidentalist. It's like. Karask, Swig, Zexy Genius, Swig, STT12345, Swig, Juga27, Swig, My Ass is on Backwards, Swig, Jassot, Swig, Umbrock, Swig, JVEP420, Swig, Wally, Swig, UU Jessif, Swig, and the Abacus, Swig, all get gifted subs from Comrade. Thanks. How many hours have you put into this? Too many at this point. If you don't like fruit, I want you to eat a pear. I do like fruit, though. <laughs> I love fruit. Thanks. Yeah, Tampa Bay Buccaneers. They're doing crazy moves, dude. Crazy moves. Thanks. Yeah, they'll probably trade uh, O.J. Howard now. Thanks. I'd imagine. Thanks. I have never had cactus fruit, no. Thanks. Dude, people just showing up. I was just talking about how the new... There's a new thing called NVIDIA RTX Voice. And it mutes Thanks. the, um, 
it mutes the uh, sounds around you, right? So if you're like banging on the desk or you have a mechanical keyboard typing or anything like that, it gets rid of it. It's crazy. And I was like, this is fantastic. Right. And then I realized it mutes my high fives, my claps. Watch. Thanks. All right. Here we go. Now watch this. Thanks. <laughs> it's crazy. Thanks. Uh, Dodger definitely needs it. Yeah, and then. It doesn't do a good job at muting, like, far away noises. Like, it's still, you would still hear kitchen noises if there's, like, clanking in the background. But yeah, that's actually really good. See, watch. Like, if I'm, like... Or, uh... Now watch. I'll turn this on. See, it's actually pretty crazy. Um, but we can't use it because it means the high fives. So, sad times. Uh, <laughs> didn't mute it completely this way lower. Well, some of the things I think it lowers. Some it mutes completely. It just depends on how obvious the sound is to it. Um, would you be willing to try more weird fruit wine if it's available to be shipped? If I can find some, I have no ideas now, but I'd fund it. Sure, if you want to fund it, I'll try it. <laughs> uh, I actually tried, uh, one of the other ones from that company, and it was awful. It's called Shadow. It's like blueberry red wine, and it was not good. <laughs> All right. Time to knock Christopher Robin out of the park. Okay, Thanks. this is just a warm up. Gotta get used to the pitches again and everything. Quaper with the nine months, save the nine months. Quaper. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Swipe. Save the nine months. Okay. Now I'm getting in the groove. This is like batting practice right here. I'm not going to win this one, but... Just get warmed up. I saw one guy speed run it. And he still struggled... To like... Hit a lot of the balls. Like he ended up finishing... With no airs left. I just accidentally unfollowed you. Oh my god. Yeah, now you gotta start anew. <laughs> Not again. We're doing it again. We're doing this until it is beat. Until it is beat. We're actually not doing too bad. So vendor's already given me the uh, the other hundred. Like I've already gotten it. So it's not even about that anymore. After three hours of playing, he gave me the other hundred. But it's about it's personal now. All right. Yeah, it's a pride thing at this point. Didn't expect the Tigger pitch. <laughs> and 
I have the Wii music going as well. Gotta have the Wii music going. Oh, fouled it. This is a pretty solid warm up. Halfway there with the uh, still hope. Look at that, I even hit the owl ball. Fouled it. Oh my god, I even hit that one. Hey, I only got 15 more and I still got an air left. I think tonight's the night we're going to get it. Tonight's the night. Well, this is the warm up round. I'm almost doing it. 12th. With an air to spare. 11. Ten. Shit, dude. Nine. Oh, there's the air. All right, we got to hit nine in a row now. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Thanks. Four. Fastball. Fastball got me. Up, oh, that one got me too. Hey, still. Not bad. First try. Listen, 37 first try. 38 first try. Big Papa Pope five months. Sports drought really hitting this bad. It is. One, two, three, four, five. <laughs> Swing. They were the five months. <laughs> 38 first try. Not bad. Not bad. All right, you know what? <laughs> we need a good opening start. There we go. 38 is a big time play. It's a big time warm up, all right? Now we make the big time plays. All right. There we go. Good, good, good. Why do you do this to yourself? Same reason I play League of Legends. The thrill of the game. It's about the thrill of the game. Shit. It's about showing you that hard work and perseverance pays off. <laughs> All right. All right. All right. <sighs> Fouled it. Fouled it. Wait. Oh, there we go. Yeah, I need to scroll up. All right, I'm going to have to restart that one. Whew, all right. Yeah, and this it's all on me. No bad teammates. Get out. 
I don't know what my signature pitch would be in this game. This is indeed a thing. <laughs> oh, the fastball. Fastball throws me off so much. Wally with the 500 bits. I was about to sub to you when I was gifted that sub. You're one of my favorite YouTubers and quickly become one of my favorite... Oh! Streamers. Thanks for being funny. Hey. Thanks. Thanks. I appreciate it. And thanks for giving the bits. You didn't have to do that. Oh my god. Comrade with the 21 thanks. gifted subs. <laughs> Thank you, comrade. For the 21 gifted subs. Thanks. Mama Mia. The Mad Lad. And Harper X with a thousand bit, dun bit nice. dunk. How's your day been, nerd? My day's been alright. Uh. It's been a pretty chill day, honestly. Thanks. I've just, uh, in fact, I've kind of been looking forward to this moment all day. <laughs> as odd Thanks. as that sounds. Oh, I see. You wanted, you really wanted me to eat the pear. We've hit the sub goal for eating the pear. Thanks. Uh. Thanks. All right. I was going to restart, but I'm in the groove now, so I'm not going to restart anymore. Thanks. Let's get in that groove, dude. Can't quit then. Thanks. I can't believe April's almost over now. We only got like another, uh, Thanks. what is it, like nine days? Thanks. I mean, now everyone's living my life. <laughs> the only reason I knew what the days were was Thanks. because uh, I'd go to the gym on certain days. And, uh, you know. <laughs> Maybe things would be closed on certain days and I'd be like, oh yeah, it's that day. Uh, Thanks. Oh yeah, and the new Big Horizon update. That's going to be nice. Nah, Buff Door isn't Thanks. that dude. I've still been doing my exercises at home to try and maintain the uh, muscle that I have. Shit. Thanks. Um, and then once the gym reopens, I'll be there. Nick's third nipple gets a sub. It's like Foxhead gets a sub. It's like Cooler gets a sub. It's like Carrera gets a sub. It's like Slugs gets a sub. It's like Bulba Rage gets a sub. It's like Thanks. Do, 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 do. Sir Northman gets a sub. It's like Keefsy gets a sub. It's like Gluo gets a sub. It's like Bob Ross gets a sub. It's like Frosty Feet gets a sub. It's like Malign gets a sub. It's like B -b 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 Path XP gets a sub. It's like Rosie Dark gets a sub. It's like Dason Crone gets a sub. It's like LG Kurtz gets a sub. It's like The Big Face gets a sub. It's like Trev Pocalypse gets a sub. It's like Yvi gets a sub. It's like Bob Art gets a sub. Or Bobbert. It's like and quick time gets a sub. It's like, thank you, comrade, for helping us get to the I eat a pear sub goal, which I will eat a pear uh, after another good round. Then I'll go get the pear. Complete rebel, 40 months. Yo, what's good? What up, complete rebel? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 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 Ooh, not a good start. Not a good start. Restart that one. You need to start on a home run. I might make my uh, Animal Crossing place into like a cat, uh, not a canyon, like a valley. I have a cool idea to make a valley, and uh, I think I'm going to do it. Get up. Do, 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 do. 
Miss. There we go. Back on track. Whew. Also, after uh, after I beat Christopher Robin, I think we're going to look into starting up Paper Mario and the Thousand Year Door. Because I really want to start playing that. I also got my new memory card, so I mean, I'm able to save it. Shit, that should have been an easy one. <laughs> oh my god, are you kidding me? Okay. Oh, I'm missing the heaters. Crushed it. Crushed it. Crushed it. Crushed it. I'm actually not doing too bad this round. We're already halfway. And as soon as I said it. <laughs> Every time. Every time, dude. I can only miss one more. That was a crazy one. I can miss zero more. <laughs> and it's over. All right. <laughs> All right. Uh, flash step cap the 36 months, three years. Hey, yo, put some Crendor Nerd Cyphers, Wowie's Mom, Mia Zayas, Pop Pop, Mary Collins in the chat for flash step at three years. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, twenty-ten, twenty-eleven, twenty-twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty, thirty-six months, one day of reckoning crew with the twenty-three months, almost year two years. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty, thirty-six, 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 twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine,
Alright. Four hours trying to be Christopher Robin. Yeah, but I've, I've split it up, alright? I'm not doing it all at once. So it's different. Okay, well, that's two fouls in a row. <laughs> Alright. I mean, I've already gotten a 38 today. Crushed it. Crushed it. Let's go. There we go. Not bad. Ooh. Five dollars cost to buy three McChickens? It could. And I'd probably rather have three McChickens than a, uh, a Twitch sub, honestly. Depends. Depends on the quality of the McChicken. Shit. Whew, got that one. Whew. Keep it up, keep it up, doing good. Got it. <sighs> Oof. Got that one. Honestly, I don't know what my furthest home run is. It's like 202 or something like that. Ooh, got that one. The zigzag. I think tonight is the night it's going to be uh, It's gonna be beaten. Without a doubt. Look at that. We're already halfway. 26 balls left. I've already gotten a 38 tonight. I think I'm just locked in. I've had two days to register. Foul it off. There we go. Back on track. 19 to go. Oh, the fastball. Fake pie, $5. Simping for Krendor. Thank you for simping for me. <laughs> I'll take what I can get. Crushed it. It's the off. It's either the off speed or the hundred mile an hour that get me. Like the these are fine. Fourteen to go. Just missed it. Thirteen. Twelve. Oh my god. <laughs> Eleven. K 
Can't miss any more. Nine. Eight. Seven. It doesn't matter after this point. It's, uh... <laughs> uh, I just want to see where I can get to. Yeah, I'm going to get the 37. Yep. So I've gotten 38. I've gotten 37. I got 39 yesterday. You just, it's all about just not messing up that last. Not even the last. It's about not messing up the like one or two easy pitches that I mess up. You gotta perfect those. Maybe the pair will help. Let's eat, let's eat the pair for energy. All right. Here's the pair. It is a red pair. I used to not even think about eating um, red pears, and then Nick mentioned they were his favorite, and I was like, I've never even tried one, and I tried it, and now it's my favorite pair. Yeah, it's an Andrew pair. Shit. It's not helping me. It's a good pair. All right, reset. It's got the juice in it. How do you not like pears? Pears are great. And Sinvicta doesn't like any fruit or vegetable. Clobbered. You love fruit, including pears? Oh, I thought you just hated all fruits and vegetables. Yes, I was wrong. Mmm. -hmm.
Dude. I think I got pair energy right now. Pair energy, dude. Fourteen home runs. I've missed one. Shit. Back on track. Shit. All right, all right. Oh, got it. Got the rough one. Oh, I didn't expect the heat. There we go, halfway point. Nineteen. Eighteen. Seventeen. Woo! Sixteen. Fifteen. Fourteen. Thirteen. Twelve. Mm. Still got contact. Eleven. Ten. Oh. <laughs> okay, there we go. Nine, nine. Oh. Eight. Seven. Two hundred. Six. Five. Two. Big pair energy. <sighs> One. Crush the owl ball, dude. It's over. Big pear energy. Who knew that the entire time all I had to do was eat a, eat a pear. 
That's all we had to do. Thanks. <laughs> the solution was in the kitchen the whole time. Crazy, dude. With the power of hard work, perseverance, and pairs. You too can defeat enemies like Christopher Robin. Constipation. And succeed in life. Thanks. Thank you. Um, oh my god, all right, <laughs> Fisher Cole, five bits, thank you for the five bits, Citizen Quinn, subscribe, thank you, Citizen Quinn, swing, Lego Snape, subscribe, thank you, Lego Snape, swing, Olay, get to the sub, the Evil Thanks. Dravak, thank you for gifting Evil Dravak a sub, swing, uh, do, 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 Vozati, with the 13 months, thank you, Vozati, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, swing, Wally with the 300 bits. Yeah, that's about. That's what it's about. That's nice. uh, that's about. Uh, cosplay the 15 months that you cosplay. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 15. Swing. Thank you for the 15 months. Lancery with the four gifted subs. Tiny Taran gets a sub. Swing. Yum Lick gets a sub. Swing. Dre Dog gets a sub. Swing. And Sir Dandy. Swing. Gets a sub. Clockwork Thistle with the two months. One, two. Swing. And X Flippy with the 200 bits. Big time players make big time plays. Thank you, X Flippy, for the 200 bits. Woo. Oh, my God. Whew. It's over. It's finally over. <laughs> All right. Um, well, I could start Paper Mario, or I could keep going with Mario Golf. Which one do you want? What the shit? Paper Mario. Okay. <laughs> Golf. Golf. Well, there's a lot of golfs. Here's the thing. I want to do Paper Mario, but I want to, like, dedicate a whole stream to it. This stream's already, like, 45 minutes in. How long is the opening of Paper Mario? Yeah, I feel like Paper Mario deserves a dedicated opening stream. Uh... Let's see. Like, how long is the opening uh, of Paper Mario? It's actually pretty short. The thing is, if it's short, I could probably play that plus the first chapter. All in one stream. And then I can upload it to YouTube.com. <laughs> Uh, all right. Everybody's voting golf too. I feel like we just got. I feel like it's a sports night. We got to keep going with the sports night, and then tomorrow night we'll start Paper Mario. How's that? Tomorrow night will be officially a Paper Mario night. All right. It'll be fully dedicated to Paper Mario, and I can tweet it, and people can show up, and bop bop bop. And I don't have to swap the game out. <laughs> I also want to beat the rings because I've gotten halfway through the rings. My absolute with the nine months. Save the nine months. My absolute. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Swag. Thank you for the nine months. My absolute.
to automatically save to this memory card in slot A. Yeah. I gotta change the title of the thing. Christopher Robin defeated. Now we go. Nice. Alright, let's Koopa Troop it. Ring attack. Alright, so I've done all these. Or wait, did I? Did I do heartburn? Hold on. I think I did finish it, right? Um... No, not slots. Let me check. Funky Pharaoh. Go. Oh, wait. So. Wait. Why can't I? Why can't I go back? Uh. Oh, I did the first two with the other guy. Never mind. I got him mixed up. So I have to do Dolphin Dreams. That's what I have to do. Uh, MacPerson's Pants with the 100 bits. I know I was in the right. I knew I was right in stopping MLB The Show to watch you demolish Christopher Robin. Good job. Thank you very much. <laughs> I'm glad you enjoyed seeing Christopher Robin uh, demolished. I can't believe Jesse didn't play GameCube. Jesse's a boomer. He plays, you know, he's got his old school games. That's fine. Again? I can't even... Can I get up there? No. I don't think... I'm just going to do this. I think we'll be good. Oh, I got it. Beautiful. That works. Yeah, GameCube was great because you had the handle. You could take it wherever. So you wanted to go to your friend's house and play it. You could do that. I need to like hit it right here. <laughs> well, hold on. 
right here. Don't go in the sand, don't go in the sand! Yeah, it was like an old school switch when you had to like, you know, clunk it around. But it was easy. Like the hardest part of the of the GameCube was like actually hooking it up to your friend's TV. But they already probably had similar systems and stuff like that, so it wasn't that bad. Right, let's try this again. Or if they had the front. Oh, that was the best. If they had the TV with the uh, ports on the front. That was a spicy Mamma Mia. Because a lot of them had it in the back of the TV. But if you had it in the front of the TV, then you were good to go. This is good enough. Now we just hit it onto the green, and then we putt. Okay. Get on! Are you kidding me? <laughs> All right. Wait, I need the... I'm still missing. How do you get the... How are you supposed to get to that ring? You have to actually hit it over there. And then, like, chip it up. Alright, I'm doing it with Koopa. I'm doing the Koopa Troopa with the star. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> wow. Beautiful shot. What? I don't think he turned on the star. He had the star on his night on his name though, didn't he? He has a star on his name. Oh, you have to click to add the star. Okay. All right. <laughs> I thought since it had the star on his name, he was good. Okay, now we're good. All right, let's tr let's go. I'm gonna try to hit. So yeah, when you hit it over there, it has to be like all the way over there. And then you have to like hit it up. Dude, this hole is insane. All right. <laughs> this hole is crazy, dude. Got the ring this time. Into the sand. And the, once you're in the sand, it's over. You can't get out of the sand. Nice. 
actually insane. And it missed. Alright. So actually, I think if I hit it like this... But at full power, it's okay. So it's not gonna... It's gonna hook a little bit, but hit the... It goes over! I keep... That's what I'm doing. I'm going over the thing. Okay. See if this works. Nice shot. Yes. Okay. Ah. <laughs> uh, the control. Oh yeah, the D-pad. You can like angle it. That's right. Okay, I'll do that. See this. Wow. <laughs> All right. Here we go. And now I hit it over it again. Dude, this hole's actually the worst. <laughs> All right. Shorten it up. You gotta actually hold the control stick. Hold on, I'll try holding the control stick. Well, do you mean the C stick or do you mean the D pad? Well, I need to redo the thing now. Uh, see you later, comrade. Thank you very much for funding the pear eating, which actually powered me to beat Christopher Robin. So thank you very much. <laughs> I mean, I see the red dot on the ball, but right now it shows that I'm hitting the top of it. There, I held the... I'm holding it up right now. And it did nothing. All right. Uh, I didn't hit the ring. Uh, I think it's because... Hold on. I think it's because it's on auto. I think it needs to be on manual in order to do that. Insane. Uh, not good, not good. Well, if I can power it. Nice shot. 
You choose it. Oh, wait, no. This is just the D-pad still. I'm pretty sure you have to have it on manual in order to do what you're saying. Bum, 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 bum. Oh my god, into the sand. Oh? Yeah, because I can do this. Like, I don't think you understand. I'm literally moving the C-stick during the backswing. I can show you, but I'm... I'll show you on the thing if I miss again. Uh... Oh, God. Whoop! Mmm... -hmm. I'm gonna try to hook this one. Oh god, this one's not gonna go... This isn't gonna go well. <laughs> okay. Alright, I did that. Okay. Uh, let's pull it back a bit. Boom! Oh wait, I've already lost. Great video today, really solid philosophy. Thanks. Thank you very much. Here, watch. I will literally show you. Alright, here's the C-stick. Alright? Literally just spamming it everywhere. And it's not showing anything on the ball. Now if I do it while I'm doing the forward hit. Still nothing. That's what I'm saying. I think it's manual only. I think auto just automatically does it. Little slice and dice here. Nice shot. Nice <laughs> Are you kidding me? All right. All right. Let's angle it down again. Good one, good one. Oh, this should be good. There we go. No! <laughs> well. No. Now what if I power it? 
like this, but over... Nope, I already started. Dude, this hole is actually the worst one <laughs> that I've played. This hole's crazy. Uh... Okay, this should go through the thing, but it's probably gonna go in the sand again. Uh, the problem is if I put too much power on it to get it over the sand. All right. Uh, oh yeah, that's a good point. I could try landing it like right here. And then for the second swing. Going through the hoop. It's not a bad idea. Alright. Uh, too much power. <laughs> I need to land it earlier than that. Well, actually. Uh... Hit it off the palm leaf. <laughs> All right. Uh. All right, right here should be good. Little, b little before. Yeah, I don't think you can backspin on auto. I don't know how to turn it off auto. And now I'm so used to auto. Oh, there we go. All right, now we're good. Now this dumb palm tree's in the way. <laughs> All right, this should be it. Okay. So here's what we're gonna do. I'm just gonna blue pit it right here. Okay. What? Oh, okay, this will get in. Or through the thing. Got it. Nice shot. And then after getting it through here, nice. I just got to chip it in and we win. <laughs> Great. It went in. Just didn't stay in. There's your problem. Too many toasters. Nice shot. I'm like, I already went back to my old ways now. I need to hit it shorter. Okay. Here we go, just uh, right here. That should be good. Nice shot. No! Well, actually, this might not be bad. I think I can still get it up there. Never mind, I can't. Okay, okay.
Probably like right here now. Okay, this should be good. This should be good. Okay, that's right where I want it. Beautiful. Quasi 9, 38 months. I was going to say something about Cox Crendor in the morning, but I forgot. Damn. It's all good. I forget things all the time. Thank you for the 38 months. Hold on, after this shot. Beautiful. Thank you for the 38 months. Thank you, game, for lying to me. It was like, yeah, you'll make it through the tree. But I didn't. I didn't make it through the tree game. All right. Oh, the wind. All right. Here we go. Little bloop. Whoa, semi rough. Uh. This should be perfect. Actually, it might go too far. Never mind. <laughs> it's going to go too far. God damn it. That's all right. I think I can still make it down here. Yeah, I can. Okay, we're good. This hole is the new Christopher Robin now. There must always be a Christopher Robin. Just like the lore said. Got the bounce. Very nice. Very good hit. Alright. So I don't want to hit it all the way. Probably right there. That's good. Just get that nice little bounce. <laughs> what? <laughs> well, I think this I think this will be okay. It's not This hole is kind of the worst, I'm not going to lie. All right. No. Right here. Here we go. to persevere. <laughs> I really do. Oh, I got the rolly. It's like they had some guy play this over and over and he was like, yeah. Yeah, I see. It. They're going to try to do this, so uh, I got an idea. <laughs> we'll really roast them here. I need to lower the shot. Step one, lower the shot. 
and reduce the distance. We're gonna go right there. This should be ideal. Line drive hit. Flap it. Perfect. Okay, I think I wasn't line driving it. That was my issue. Now you got the seagulls being like, bah! Bah! This might be too far. Nice Gonna find out. Oh, this is actually... Very nice. This is it. This is it, dude. What? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? This doesn't count? This, do this doesn't count. So I literally have to... <laughs> Ship it a foot this way. Nice. <laughs> and now try to chip it in again. Oh my god, I hit it too hard. Nice shot. It's gonna go right in the hole. Or not. <laughs> wow. You can't make this stuff up. Okay, here we go. I can't believe it, dude. I would have had it. I would have chipped it on, putted it in, game over. That was it. At least we got that one. Oh my god, alright. <laughs> Star Pig Max 500 bits. They were the 500 bit Star Pig Max. Well, that's not far enough. I can go for another chip in here, so if I just like. Oh, that's too far. Well, you deserve a reward for finally conquering such a challenge as Christopher Robin's Strange Dash. Be proud of you finally beating a 10 year old. <laughs> Somebody, you know. Somebody's got to do it. Huh. Ooh, uh, thank you very much for the 500 bits. Well, there it is. All right. Here we go. Right here. This might be too short. No, we got the win. We're good. Whew. No, I have to beat this game mode because I need to unlock the character. I'm already halfway done. Unlocking all the rings. I'm not gonna stop now. Well, I got the ring, so I can just go for the uh, the beach hit here. And we're actually in a really good spot. Okay. <laughs> Never mind. Chip in. <laughs> I keep hitting it 
perfect power when I don't want perfect power. I want like one under or two under. Vertiguous with the 59 months. Save with the 59 months. Vertiguous. Swipe. Save with the 59 months. Vertiguous. Thank you, thank you. Almost to the big 6 0. Oh. Five years. Jiminy Johnson's. God, are you kidding me? Okay. All right, shot. I got it. It's just, uh, yeah, no, I didn't get it. <laughs> Beep dogs, the 13 months, like the 13 months. Beep dogs, one, two, three, four, five, six. Swipe. They were the 13 months. Beep dogs. Do I still play Animal Crossing? Yes, I play every day. Every day. Whoops. Uh oh, too hard. Uh oh. Oh my god. This is actually great. Wow. Perfect. This should be right on. Alright, we're in the sand. That's fine. I can power hit it out of the sand. Right here. I always don't hit it top power when I'm hitting out of the shitty ass saying. <laughs> Come on. There <laughs> Ass. And it's the time I need it the most. Can I like... <laughs> How do I change the putter? How do I change the max putt? Is it another thing where I'm on I'm on auto so it won't let me? Oh, no, there it is. Okay. Well, actually, I think medium will be good. Nice. Okay. And now 
Oh, this is it. The chip. Complete. Oh my god. It's over. It's over. I think the power messed it up. I swip, I, I swip swap to a power swing and they goofed it. All right, here we go. I overcomplicated it. There it is. Nice. Are you kidding? Missing the ultimate power by one. <laughs> okay. There it is. There it is. And I hit it over. Are you kidding? <laughs> This, okay, this, this'll hit. This should hit. Nice shot. Yes! Oh, got it. Now he's gotta put it away. Par four. Mia. Jerpop, 14 months, virtual Crandorian golf club. Thank you, Jerpop. Swag. They were the 14 months. Wacky weather. We got some wacky weather out here. What's going on? All right. Where are the rinks? There's one. I see two rings. I don't see the third ring. Are they... Am I blind? It's above the hole. Oh, okay. That makes more sense then. Great, great shot. Nice shot. Are you kidding me? <laughs> okay. What if? Line rabbit. Get on. You shit. gonna hit the tree <gasps> okay
Is this accounting for me being in the rough? Because I don't know if it is. Nice shot. It is. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I lose a stroke, but if I can just... Heavy rub. Here we go. That's short, but I think we're okay. Oh, we are okay. Fair away. Let's go. Twenty two mile an hour winds. Oh, wait, seven mile an hour wind. Okay. Yeah, that's the that's the ring. I think we got it. Okay. All right. Okay. <laughs> sure. Nice shot. Not bad. Get up. Okay. <sighs> you can't get it, but you can't get the water hazard. When you get the water hazard, you lose a stroke, and you gotta make it on this shot, otherwise it's over. But I'll do it anyway. Nice shot. Nope. Actually, if I just get it, like, right on that same, it's not too bad. Oh, boy. <laughs> okay, let's go short. Now I hit the tree. Of course. I wish it aimed towards the rings instead of being like, Hey, you trying to get to the hole? And it's like, no, I'm playing a thing where I have to hit the rings game. And it's like, I don't know. We should go for the hole. All right, we're restarting that one. Should be right on the same. Good, good, good. The beach bunker. Now, we're looking to hit it. Probably about right there. Beautiful. Painful, dude. Okay. <laughs> Gamma. Okay. Hey. 
Well. Hit a three wood. Bit of a laser shot. What was that? It should be right there. Are you kidding me? Maybe I just need to hit some high arcing shots. Maybe that's all I need. I think that's it. The win, of course. The higher you hit it with the, the wind, the further the wind will take it. All right, this should be good. Good. All right, now, get a bit of an arc on that ball. Okay, right here. Right here. Nice shot. Oh, we're good. We're good. This should be easy. No, 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 no. Lift it, lift it. Okay. We're still in this. I just have to <laughs> do a little bit of magic. Nice shot. Chip nice. up. Roll. Roll. No. All right. That's our. That's the best one yet. Best one yet. Let's go. Stupid shit kid tree. All right, restart, restart, restart. Here we go. Oh, that's too far. Well, I guess it's not too bad. Actually, it's pretty good. Okay, this should be good. Good. In the rough, though, that's not great, but... If I just arc it up here. Right. Right. Okay. <laughs> All right. BK for killing him 30 months. Save the 30 months. What did you <laughs> Thank you for the 30 months. Man. Sometimes. 
Got to say, I found the annual grass glass bones. Greg videos quite hilarious. Just football nerd myself. Hell yeah, dude. I'm going to be doing one for Madden 04 since I got that for GameCube. I think it'll be fun. <laughs> boom, 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 boom. Where is it? Right, uh, right here. Got my Madden 04. Ready to go. All right. Whoops. Didn't mean to do that. Come on. Nice shot. We are doing a draft stream. Yep. It'll be Thursday. We'll probably start it up like 30 minutes before the actual draft starts. And it'll be right here on Twitch TV Crandall. You gotta be kidding me. Uh, yeah, Mike McCarthy's not a bad coach. He's just not... He's not, like, an innovative coach. You kind of know what you're getting. I mean, it's possible he, like re-innovated and like readjusted reimagined his offense and everything but as somebody who watched him for uh, his entire career the issue was he couldn't adjust to the modern like NFL but maybe with like a year off he actually did adjust as possible he's not a bad coach I do think it's funny though that the Cowboys went from Jason Garrett, who was like, I'm not going to use Emmett Smith. And everyone was like, everyone or they're just like, use Emmett Smith. Like, please. Or not Emmett Smith. What are we in the 90s? Uh, Ezekiel Elliott. <laughs> uh, and then Mike McCarthy had the exact same issue in Green Bay with Aaron Jones. He would be like, oh, guys, Aaron Jones is running for, like, 10-yard carries. Let's th let's stop using him. And everyone's like, what are you doing? Why? <laughs> it was so dumb. So maybe he's fixed his mindset in that time span? I don't know. Uh, I'm very happy with Matt LaFleur. Very happy we moved on. Matt LaFleur, great coach. Love his game plan. Uh, I like it. <laughs> I'm happy with the Packer organization. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Now we just need some wide receivers. Let's go. Oh, my God. If we'd, like, traded up and got C.D. Lamb or, uh, uh, what's his name? The other guy in this draft. Jerry Judy. That's it. I would be ecstatic. I'd also be ecstatic if we took, like, uh, any of the other wide receivers. Ah! Uh! it's a deep wide receiver uh, deep wide receiver draft which is really pretty nice uh, let's see here we go okay I'm thinking the Packers probably will just take the best player on the board, and then they'll probably take the best receiver on the board, actually. Get up! Too far up! God, I hate this hole. <laughs> you have to play it so perfectly. I hate it.
Come on. Come on. Get him. Too hard. Like, you have to hit it hard. I'm hitting it. I'm hitting as far under the ball as I can. And you gotta hit it hard. Otherwise, you can't get up the hill. But you gotta get up the hill. Oh? Well. It's not gonna work, but... I'll try it. Uh, Packers might take a quarterback in like the s depends. They could take one in like the second or third round. Honestly, it wouldn't surprise me. And there's a decent amount of quarterbacks. If you listen to our most recent uh, three guys talk about football, Rob did a breakdown of all the quarterbacks. There's actually some pretty good quarterback depth. And there's a few like project quarterbacks that'd be really good to sit behind Aaron Rodgers for like, you know three years, two, three years. Or if he gets injured or something, which is possible, because he does like to get injured. <laughs> Pretty easily. Boop. <gasps> okay. Do they really do this? Do they really put a sand pit in the middle to just give you the middle finger? Nice shot. I'm excited for the NFL draft. It's going to be fun. I'm excited for every NFL draft, but this one especially because of lack of sports. And I think it's going to be a shit show, and I can't wait. Nice Woo! Shot. Come on! Oh, my God. There it is. This is it. This is it. I got like two more tries in me for this hole. <laughs> in fact, Mario Golf Toadstool or Ring Shot character. Who do you get from doing this? Very on better all 18 old like button news, that's the putting pressure to this side game lock PD Piranha it's actually a ring mode to get Shadow Mario. Oh, so this gets you Shadow Mario. I don't even want Shadow Mario. <laughs> I don't care about Shadow Mario. Why am I doing this? But uh yeah, we'll be live streaming the draft right here, so if you're around, stop on by. Should be a good time. Nice shot. Who will be this year's Joan Taylor? That's a little meme from last year. <laughs> Joan Taylor. Okay. Nice okay. Nice. <gasps> oh, this is it. All I gotta do is chip it in.
too hard. All right, I don't give a shit about Shadow Mario anymore. Don't care. Watch your stuff since then. Release Dragon Soul Cinema. Never went to the stream and they cut. You want to say thanks for many years of awesome my content? Hey, thanks, dude. Thank you very much. Yeah, I've just, uh. I've just been streaming random ass shit tonight. <laughs> but I'm glad you could catch a stream. Uh. Let's see. What is it? 208? Alright. I'm gonna do, uh. One tournament, and I'm gonna play it as Wario, because I don't know why. I just want to play Wario. Uh, yeah. Tournament. The cheap, cheap tournament. Are you ready to play? <laughs> you know it. That Wario wind-up, though. What hour is the live stream draft? It's Thursday at uh, uh, I think it's like seven Eastern. I don't know if it's eight Eastern or seven Eastern. I think it's seven. Woo! Nice song. What the shit is he putting? I actually hate Wario. <laughs> okay. He's like got the worst golfing mechanics. <laughs> oh. All right. Um. Love how I stumble on the stream. You've stumbled into madness. And by madness, I mean mediocrity. Snow Monster, two months. Hi, what up, Snow Monster? One, two. What? Thank you for the two months. Uh, let's see. NFL. Draft. Hey, look, everybody's having an earthquake in California. NFL Draft Thursday. Uh, I know it's on Thursday thing. When? 8 p.m. Eastern. Okay, so 8 p.m. Eastern, 7 Central. What? What? <laughs> Are you kidding? Guess I'll just, uh, you know, hit it over here. <laughs> Neat. Nice shot. I don't like Wario. All right. <laughs> nice shot. Thanks. Okay. How's this? It's a little better? Alright. <laughs> in this game, I like Wario in general. Just not in this game. Okay, that's better. How I feel. Davy Gunface, four months. Hey, Crender, love the new video and remind me that I do indeed have $5. Thanks for all the entertainment. Thank you very much, Davy. 
Good. For choosing me over choosing a McDonald's chicken sandwich. Because I probably would have chosen McDonald's. I'm not going to lie. Alright, back it up a bit. A little alright. Actually, this is like... Hope you're having a good stream. Just wanted to say thanks for all the content playing WoW for almost 15 years. Cool little OG content creators, so there's still still around. Yeah, thanks, dude. I forgot that there's like so many people that don't actually do anything anymore. <laughs> like Mind Flame. I know Oxhorn still does stuff. Are you shitting me? Okay. <laughs> Alright, at least I part it. I have something in my eye. Uh, all right, I gotta make some plays out here. It's raining. Let's get a big time lap. You're like one of the only OG Wrath WoW YouTubers that I know even doing things still. Who are the other ones? I should probably know them. Well, there's actually a decent amount. I can I can see them in my head, but I don't know their names. God, lightning hit my golf ball. Nice, on. nice up. Hard. That's it. Are you kidding? Nice All right. <laughs> Ram got 24 months. Nice shot. Thank you for the 24 months, two years. Put some Krendor nerd cyphers. Why is mommy's eyes? Bop, 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 bops in the chat. For Ram guy, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, Swag! Save for the 24 months. Ram guy. Yeah, I never thought uh, Oxhorn would get into, like, Fallout. Of all things. Oh, here we go. Just curve it a bit. What? I didn't even want it to go that way. Oh yeah, all the, uh, the music. Uh, the music YouTubers. That's not it. Too short. Uh, I'm in 10th place. <laughs> Little win. Get up. Get up. Woo. That's it. Bam. Doesn't even show the hole. All right, up to eight. I think the biggest mistake a lot of people make is they, uh... Oh, I gotta do this. Is they get stuck in that they have to do one thing, right? Like, they're like, I have to do WoW music. I have to do whatever. When really, you just gotta do what you want. And if people are like, I miss the things you used to do, just be like, well, go watch them. <laughs> nice 
my favorite people like, you've changed. And it's like, well, yeah, it's been 10 years. If you don't change in 10 years, that's probably a bad thing. <laughs> you know? Power shot! Right here. Got it. Nice shot. Oh, nice on. Damn. Thirty five. Not enough power. Too much. Not enough curve on it anyway. All right. Nice ball. At least I parted. <laughs> All right. Ba -do -ba -do -ba -do. All right, we're halfway through. Nice <laughs> <laughs> I hate Wario's putter grip. I think that's what I hate the most about him. It's the putter grip. I don't think I can get over that. Um, but yeah, you know, that's my thing, right? I just play what I want to play. If I'm going to play Mario Golf, I want to play Mario Golf. If I'm going to play Christopher Robin Winnie the Pooh Home Run Derby, I'm going to play it because I want to play it. And if I get like a hundred viewers or if I get a thousand viewers, I don't give a shit. Now, granted, I'm in a lucky enough situation to where I can do that and just be like, whatever. Some people have to like be like, I got to get the views, got to get the money, whatever. But, I mean, there's other ways you can do that. Like, make your sub goal eat a piece of fruit. Easy. Here we go. Nice Boom! Now we're going. Very well done. Yeah. Boop, 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 boop. All right, we're moving up. I didn't even look at my score, but I know I'm moving up. Yeah, just put Twitch Drops enabled in your title. There you go. Get some Mario Golf Twitch Drops right here, right now. Right here. Oh, I, mean, I just I would have had it. Boom. I feel like some of you YouTubers go can play some fall specific channel, never venture out of it. My favorite YouTubers want us to do what they want because they generally enjoy it. Yeah. You have to become an entertainer. You have to grow your personality, not like what you do, who you are. That's it. That should be like a life goal thing. It's not what you do. It's who you are. Buy my book. <laughs> Growing your personality. Uh, okay. Yo, this ball's not going in. Actually, if I get a little wind on it. Nice to be fair, some collections can be horribly toxic. Some streams can probably do the kind of pressure your die or some league comes to mind. Yeah, that's true. Uh, that is... Well, that's part of the problem, right, with... The way in which... That's why every situation is different, right? Because it depends the type of audience you've grown. His type of audience started watching him because he was, like, very good at League of Legends. So when you make bad plays, or, you know, any type of thing where... It's it's the type of audience you grew. So if you grow an audience where they they expect, like, I watch good gameplay because you're good at game, that, I feel like that's going to become more toxic compared to, like, I watch this guy because he's funny. <laughs> right? Then again, there are some very toxic, funny audience as well, but it's... Uh, I always like to think 
Uh, the streamer kind of builds the audience. Not build, well, the streamer or entertainer, they kind of cater, their, not cater, what's the word? They kind of, like, prune it, you know what I mean? Like, you're... Hold on. Cultivate, that's a good word. Yeah, they cultivate it. And I think the chat resembles that streamer. So when people come in here, they're like, Wow, this chat's so slow and boring. And I'm like, yeah. Like me. Nice. Uh, well, you can go into another chat with like 600-something people. Or a lot of, I mean, like a thousand, two thousand. And it'll just be non-stop, just toxicity in our city. In our city. Uh, all right. So yeah, when you're chill, you gener generally bring in chill types of chats. But that can also, you know, that also has exceptions. That's the problem, is nothing is like black or white. It's all, it's very grayscale. I mean, look at Crypt. Crypt is a really chill guy, but his chat is uh, insane. <laughs> But he's also the type where it's almost like Dyrus, where he's just good at games, and so you get a lot of people that are very, uh, you know, you get a lot of elitist people. I mean, <laughs> that also kind of comes with Hearthstone. When I play Hearthstone, <laughs> I get those people in chat, especially in YouTube. YouTube's the worst with Hearthstone. Come on. Sometimes it's just the game. <laughs> you know what I mean? That's what, that's actually a lot of it. Sometimes it's really just the game. A lot of competitive multiplayer games have more toxic chats than, you know, single player games. Oh, I get this right in. Nice shot. Woo. Oh, that's okay. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. Can I just put this up? Could have worked. Well, it kind of worked. I mean, <laughs> wasn't the uh, not enough power? Shit, dude. Yeah, my chat's like this all the time. At least like 95% of the time. I also think it's because it's also an older chat. Most of the people here probably started watching me back like 5, 10 years ago. And so people started watching when they were like 18 or like 28 now <laughs> and stuff like that. Etc. While with a lot of other streams, a lot of them build their stream through games like Fortnite, Overwatch, even a lot of the WoW audiences like younger. Uh, oh my god, I'm back in first tied with Yoshi. Sandwich Man, 43 months. Great speech about doing whatever you want to do, Kren Dog. Thank you, Sandwich Man. Play with the 43 months. Like, for example, um, there's a lot of streamers that I'll watch. I'm not going to name names. But sometimes, I just like watching them when they just, you know, they chill out, they're talking about whatever, maybe they're playing a game, doing something. But sometimes, 
Uh, I hate when it becomes like an audi- it becomes like a catering to the audience type thing. I get why they do it, but it's like... I f I think I hate it because I know how fake it is, but I don't think other people know how fake it is because they're either too young or they're just gullible. And I don't care. Uh, I don't care that they're doing that. They can do whatever they want. It's just my personal taste is I'm like, I just, I don't find this enjoyable entertainment. You know what I mean? Oh! <laughs> nice touch, thanks. Why are streamers who watch Secret? They're not Secret. I just don't like calling people out. Especially because Twitch has a thing of like, you're not supposed to, like, badmouth other streamers and stuff like that. I don't know what's considered what, so I'm just like, whatever. I've done this for 11 years. I know to never, uh, you, know, you don't burn bridges. And if you're uncertain if something's gonna, you know, start a spark, you don't say anything. Where the, where's the hole? Oh, it's a dog leg. Uh. Nice shot. There we go. A little bit of a bloop. Pack it up a little bit. Give it the old clip clap. Yeah, unless they're your friend, like Sam. I don't give a shit about Sam. If he does some shit, I'll be like, dude, Strip was doing some dumb shit the other day. What an idiot. I don't care. Uh, do, 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 do. Oh, the curve! Too much curve. Uh, alright. Well, part it. Boop, boop, boop. Um... I have played golf R. Yes, I usually play four or five times a year. It's great. I love golfing. I'm not great, but uh, you know, I'm good enough to have fun and not be terrible. Put it in. There it is. There it is. Good power. Didn't curve it enough. Alright. As long as we just keep the par going. Still in first. Up by two. Oh, wait. Is it over? Oh, that was the last hole. I win. <laughs> Wow. I got the Crystals Award. <laughs> Neat. Alright, you know what? I'm gonna try that hole again. Alright, hold on. It's got impact control, but no spin. What if I try with... Wario? Where is it? Uh... Wacky weather? I think it's wacky weather. It is. Um. Yeah, I don't really get angry. Uh, uh, something would have to like go crazy for me to get angry. It's like I said. It's uh. Yeah, I get frustrated. Um. 
Yeah, especially driving. Driving will do it. Driving, I'll just be like, what are you doing, you dumbass? Like, I get passive-aggressive angry. But usually I just swear it out, you know? And then I'm good. Oh. All right. Can I get it up the hill? Oh. This isn't looking too good. Uh, no. I don't... Even in League of Legends, I've never, like, smashed anything or anything. If there's a game that's gonna make me smash something, it's League of Legends. League of Legends. And, uh... <laughs> it did not. Nice shot. Nice. <gasps> Too bad it's a par 4. Mage wins 58 months. They're the 58 months Mage wins. What the fuck? They were the 58 months. Mage wins. Closing in on 60. Uh, but yeah. Uh, I was gonna say, when I was a kid, or like in high school, like the only times, like I would get frustrated, right? If there's like that kid being annoying or something. Like there's that one kid, every day he would just like poke me like that. And he'd be like, hey, hey. And he would just keep poking me. And the one day I just snapped. And I didn't, like, get angry. I was just like, blah, blah, blah. I just grabbed this finger. <laughs> and I just bent it back. And I was like, quit fucking poking me. And he stopped. And then he was like, you're gonna break it. You're gonna break it. <laughs> I'm like that person. I'm just like, just, I, I hit a breaking point, And I'm just like... <laughs> and then I snapped his finger in half, yeah. Uh, all right. Well, me. Why did I come back to this? I figured I could do it on Wario or like you know a different person. Or like in sixth grade, we were playing in the snow and some kid like I don't remember. He was like bullying me. He kept shoving me, and so I like jumped on his back and slammed his head into the tennis court fence. Then we had to go to the principal's office. And I was like, he was bullying me, so I slammed his head into a fence. The other kid was like, blah, blah, and then the principal was, was like, don't do it again. Nice shot. <laughs> like, look, it's one of those things where, like, if I got to defend myself, if I got to do something crazy, I can do it. But for the like vast majority of the time, 99.9% .9 of the time, you know, I'm just doing my thing. I'm not a pushover, I guess what it is. But I'm not, like, gonna get angry. Mm. Come on. Woo! Get up. Oh, yeah, that's the common thing. When the bully gets bullied, that's when they're just like, <laughs> Classic. Uh... Can I get this in the hole? It's probably not gonna go in, but we'll try. Nice. No. How are you supposed to- I hate this hole. This is the dumbest shit. Uh... <laughs> Let's see. I'm gonna do one more. Uh, one more try on this one, and then I really am giving up on it. <laughs> Alright, so... The biggest thing today was we beat Christopher Robin. That's all that matters from today. In fact, when I was watching that Masterclass... I don't know if anyone listened to the recent Cox and Prendor, but I did a Masterclass on, uh... FBI negotiation. I watched, like, the guy that was, like, an FBI negotiator for, like, 20 years or something. And a lot of the tips he teaches are things I already kind of did, but now I know what they are. <laughs> and I'm like, cool, dude. Now I can even employ these further for, like, negotiation and stuff. Watch you for years, had no idea you streamed until I watched your new vid. Hi. Yo, what up? 
Welcome to the stream. Yeah, a master class on FBI negotiation. The only reason I found out about it was a YouTube advertisement. <laughs> I think I was watching the Cox and Crendor or something, and it played an ad of like this guy, and he's like, let me teach you how to negotiate. I'm an FBI negotiator, and this is my master class. And I was like, dude, I want to watch this guy's master class, so I did. And it was cool. I'm glad I did. Oh. How is this? <laughs> the thing is lying to me. It keeps being like, oh yeah, you'll get there, and then you don't get there. Uh, so it's, all right, I'm gonna try it again. The wind was blowing straight, right? I don't know. Oh, maybe it was blowing back. Maybe I am the one who is wrong. Um, ooh, there we go. Um, but one of the uh, one of the best tips they give for negotiating is to have they call it the late night DJ voice, and it's literally just me talking normally. <laughs> oh, that's not going up. Yes. They're like, when you when you negotiate the people, right? Or you get into an argument, right? Think about when normal people get into arguments, right? You have two people. One person's like, what are you doing? And the other person's like, I don't know what I'm doing. And then they both start raising their voice. They start yelling. The dog starts barking. They're just like, what do you think I'm doing? So you counter that by just being calm and just being like, hey, what are you doing? And if they're like, I don't know what I'm doing, you know, you're just like, well, if we just, you know, so, I mean, think about it. What are you, what are you doing? And then instinctively, because humans mirror everything, if someone's laughing, people laugh. If someone's smiling, people smile. If someone's sad, people get sad. So by mirroring that, you've instinctively kind of calmed them down. Because if someone's like screaming, like, blah, 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 and you're just like, hey, what's going on? They're going to be like, eh. eh. It throws them off, because they expect you to be like, What are you fucking doing? <laughs> right? So that's just... Uh, I always kind of knew that, but hearing it from an FBI negotiator was actually pretty cool. Oh my god. Alright. Uh, start over. Um... And I remember we did that, uh, I actually did that not that long ago. We were in the parking lot, and this woman was getting mad because I parked, like, close to her. Here's the thing, I parked close to her, so she had, like, not as much room, but she didn't have a lot of room because she parked so close to the line. So I was like, I'm in the parking spot, I'm not parked on the line, so really I'm not at fault here. So, when she came out, she was like, Oh my god, blah, blah. and I was just, I wasn't like, What do you fucking do? I was like, okay. I parked in the line. And I just kept repeating it. I was like, I parked in the line. And I just kept saying it in like a just generic, monotone voice of like, I don't know what you want me to do. I parked in the lines. I parked between the lines, right? Or I parked between the lines. That's what I was saying. And after like the third time, she just like gave up and was like, blah, 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 and then I just like went into her car. Nice shot. <laughs> uh, all right. Ooh, all right. So, uh, there you go. The other tactics are uh, mirroring. I was doing it to Jesse on the podcast just to, like, <laughs> you know, just to do it to him. You know I had to do it to him. Uh, which is you take what somebody's saying, so they might be like, you didn't you didn't park your car correctly, and you kind of just mirrored it, like, I didn't, I didn't park my car correctly, and they'll be like, yeah, you didn't park your car correctly, and you're just like, 
I didn't park my car correctly. And eventually they'll be like, yeah, you're supposed to park between the lines. And you keep going of like, I didn't, I'm supposed to park between the lines. And then they're like, yeah, that's just what you do. And if you like keep doing that, you're like, it's a mind game thing where you're not really saying that you did something wrong, but you're also not saying that they did anything wrong. And so, <laughs> uh, you're kind of, you know, you're like, you're working the situation to like calm it down. So you're saying all this in like a calm voice. Uh, and then, hold on, if I can get up here. <laughs> it's a mind game thing. Yeah, it's a mind game thing. It's a mind game <laughs> Uh, the other thing they say is labeling. I'm not very good at labeling yet. I'm not trying to become an FBI negotiator. Uh, but labeling <laughs> is essentially you put a you put a, a label on an emotion. So you'll be like, that sounds like it's making you frustrated. And I don't know why, but they talk about how there's like a study where if you label an emotion, I don't think it's the amygdala. There's a part of your brain, it might be the amygdala, where it, they did studies uh, on it, and when they would when they would do that, that part of the brain would light up. So that part of the brain would react to that. And so that's why they started doing it in like FBI negotiations. So they would be like, right, say it's like some GTA drug lord, right? And he's just like, oh, I was trying to make a deal. And they're just like, you're trying to make a deal? And he's like, yeah, I was trying to make a deal. And they're like, it sounds like it made you upset. He'd be like, yeah, it made me upset. I was trying to do the thing. And then they're like, so you're trying to still do the thing. And he's like, yeah. I was and it's like, <laughs> it, the, the whole premise of it is you're never accusing someone or you're never asking questions. You're never like, why did you do this thing? What did you do? You're not like bombarding them with questions. You're just kind of working information out. So it's actually really interesting. I don't know. I just found it interesting more than anything. Uh, start it over. And I notice I do a lot of those things just naturally. Not like specifically, but sometimes, you know, I'll repeat something back to someone just because it shows that you're listening to them. Uh, not in like that type of way. Not like, like if Jesse were to say something like, oh man, I went to the park the other day. I'm not going to be like, you went to the park the other day? I might be like, Oh, you went to the park the other day, what happened? Where I, like, I'm technically mirroring it, but I'm mirroring it in, like, not an FBI negotiation way. Oh. Ooh. Uh. And then, uh, obviously the other thing's the way you say it. I think they had something where it was like, Oh, if I hold down Z, it does a... Huh. Uh, Roller T with the gifted sub to Battle Nibs. Thank you for gifting Battle Nibs a sub. It's like. Thank you very much for the gifted sub. And thank you for the six months. Hope you're having an amazing day, Krendor. Thanks. I am. One, two, three, four, five, six. Swig. Thank you for the six months. It's about letting them give you information, empathizing, pretending. Yeah. Well, that's the thing. It's like empathy just means you're understanding their point of view. It doesn't mean you have to agree with their point of view, but it means you understand the other person's point of view. And so when you understand why someone's thinking the way they are, it allows you to communicate better. Uh... I would definitely not be a good FBI negotiator. I have too much anxiety to ever do that. <laughs> nice shot! Nice shot. Whip, whip, whip. Alright, there we go. Um, let's see. Yeah, body language. I think that, what was it? It was like 735 50 something. It's like some <laughs> some ratio like that. Where 7% of what you're saying matters, 30-something percent of how you say it, and 50-something percent of uh, your body language. When you're doing, uh, like, communication type stuff. Here we go. 
I mean, how you say something is, like, extremely important. So, I mean, you could just think about it, right? Somebody will be like, I want to go to the park today. And you could be like, let's go to the park. Or you could be like, let's go to the park. And one of them is going to be like, nice, let's go. And the other's going to be like, oh, you don't want to go. And they'll be like, I didn't say I didn't want to go. And they'll be like, no, I heard it in your tone of voice. Right? <laughs> like, how you say something is extremely impactful on whatever you're saying. I mean, that's what, like, sarcasm and deadpan humor can stem from, too. It's how you say something. Uh... <laughs> yeah, it's the 500 flavors of I'm fine. There you go. Uh, I don't know. I always find those types of things interesting, which is why I enjoy psychology and marketing and all that shit. Ugh. Okay. All right. I'm doing this one more time, and then I'm done. <laughs> it's almost 3 a.m. I can't do this anymore. This is getting worse than Christopher Robin at this rate. <laughs> so yeah, if you ever want to learn more about that, check it out on Masterclass. It's on Masterclass. Uh, and the only reason I had Masterclass is to watch the David Lynch Masterclass. <laughs> so I was like, well, I may as well get some use out of this. And then I'm going to watch the Go uh, Gordon Ramsay Masterclass, and maybe he'll teach me how to cook better. I don't know. We'll see. Enjoy your beard. Thanks. <laughs> Great 007 NL 56 months. Now watch this drive. Six. Woo. Oh my God. All the booze are flying by. All right. I'm done. Get me out. <laughs> All right. Uh, well, hey, the biggest point of the stream was that we beat Christopher Robin in the Winnie the Pooh Home Run Derby. That's That was the main thing I wanted to accomplish, and we accomplished it. So, that was a, 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 a successful stream. Uh, oh, is it playing the thing? Whatever. Okay. Uh, so, hey, thanks for watching, everybody. If you're new here, click the follow button. Follow along. Be alerted when I go live. Also, check out all the links below the stream. There's a whole bunch of links down there. There's Krenzlaw Sweatpants, Discord, Twitch Prime, Patreon, Jinx, Tips, Chrono, Chrono, Chrono GG, YouTube, Twitter, Facebook, subscribe, Instagram, all down below. Check it all out. Uh, also, thanks to everybody who did subscribe. Uh, resubscribe, drop bits, drop tips, gifted subs, or just hung out and watched the stream. Thank you very much. And I'll be back tomorrow with Paper Mario. We're going to be starting up the uh, the Thousand Year Door. So that should be fun. I don't know if I'm going to play it like every day or I'm going to do it like I played Paper Mario 64 where I do it once a week. We'll figure it out. Uh, either way, I'll be playing that tomorrow. Also, I'm going to be on Dan Giesling's uh, live stream tomorrow at like 3 p.m. Eastern. He's doing and he was like, hey, Krendor, do you want to be interviewed by me, Dan Giesling? And I was like, sure, Dan. I will do that. <laughs> I'll be on that. And uh, Thursday, we will be live streaming the NFL Draft. Me, Sinvicta, and Rob, and maybe Bear Taffy if he's around. Uh, and that will be a fun time. So, fun week coming up. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you tomorrow. Okay? Okay. See ya. <laughs>